Stuart Griffiths, who was one of my oldest friends from CPC, had been appointed program director and phoned me up and told me he'd refuse to take the job unless he could talk me into coming back as chief producer because he said he knew nothing about television. And I said, Griff, forget it. It's all over and done with. I'm considering this other job down here. And they were offering me $165 a week. <laughs> And the, the, the fee offer in New York, I had an agent by now, went up to eventually $1,500 a week as against the CBC's 165 But uh, for a whole variety of reasons, uh, I just felt the more money they were offering, the more it looked like prostitution. <laughs> <laughs> and so I came back to Canada to start the television with Griffiths. And what year did you come back? I came back in 1950. 1950. Yeah, and how long were you then at the CBC then doing that? For four years, I did the, I did the whole of the training program. Griffiths and I hired all the others. Right. And then I supervised the training program, in which we brought in help from the states and from Britain. I went over to BBC and and worked with them for a little while. And the names of the directors who came out of that program? Do you remember any of them? Oh. Well, all the ones, all the ones who went uh, on to do things. Not the most famous, Norm Jewison, who was uh, only a floor manager. By that time, I think we had the uh, the names uh, pretty well settled, but Norman Campbell was one. Um, and and uh, uh, Ross uh, Stewart and... Uh, oh... The memory gets too stuffed. But know. Norman Jewison was a floor manager, was he? He was a floor manager, and Ted Kotcheff was in an even humbler post. He wanted to be a director, and I thought he'd be a good one. But I said, I can only offer you a job as a stagehand, and he took it. Hmm. That was where, uh, where he began. Um, Arthur Hiller, of course, there was, there was a long... And then right. all, all of them went on, of course, to... Paul Almond, was he in that group? No, Paul came from Montreal. Right. Uh, Sid Newman did come, however, from Montreal from the film board. He was uh, one of our great originals who went over and revitalized BBC drama. This is something that few Canadians know much about, the fact that the energy at the CBC and how the CBC pushed through early, in fact energize some of the BBC and some of the English television programs. Oh yeah, and Gunnar Rugheimer, for instance, who was head of news, went over to be head of uh, news for Irish television and eventually head of the whole works. Yeah. So they ended up in, in, in odd places. Peter MacDonald retired early, but I'm the only survivor of the original uh, core group. There were nine of us. Five in Montreal, because the head of television was Al Wimet, and uh, four in Toronto. Uh, and uh, so we, we were the ones who laid out the course and hired the other people to do it. 